such a pleasure. Thank you. For, thank you for. Yeah. It's a pleasure oh, to meet such you as well. A pleasure. Yes, yes. So tell me a little bit about the first time you saw the show. How did you feel? I mean, I, well, you know, I've been working with Emily and Murph for so long yeah. that I've, you know, really seen them like develop their voice together. So I don't feel like I've seen it for the first time. Like I've been, you know, seeing it evolve yeah. over the years. And I've been, they are both so funny and they're, they have such a specific, cool, unique voice that, you know, I'm just, uh, yeah, I'm so thrilled that it's like finally getting the big, the big, the big name and lights it deserves, you know? Totally. Yeah. What do you think fans are going to be most pleasantly surprised about? Uh, I would say, uh, you know, what I love about Emily Axford so much is that she seems so nice and so sweet, but in reality, she is a disgusting person, <laughs> and disgusting noises and fluids are always coming out of her for comedic, for comedic yeah, effect, yeah. you know what I mean? Oh, okay, and so she'll really surprise you with, like, a gross turn or a take <laughs> comedy-wise. Makes me laugh so hard, and it gets me every single time, so I think people are really going to like it. Yeah. Okay, so craziest dating experience. Oh God. Um, you know, I wouldn't say this is crazy, but I remember so distinctly when I was in my twenties that it was it wasn't until I would do online dating. I was so bad at dating. I was very awkward. It's very uncomfortable. I'm still not. If I was, I've now I've been in a happy relationship for for almost ten years. It, but if I would, I'm sure I'd be this awkward again if I were to be single. Um, uh, I I finally realized that it took me so long to figure out that when a girl, uh, when a girl's friends suddenly show up at the bar that you were on a date at, that's like a trick. That's like <laughs> she texted them and oh. for a rescue. And that happened to me three times before I figured out. She's like, oh, my friends are here. Yay, now I'm talking to them. I was like, oh, this was a bail me out of this bad date text. Gosh, three times, same girl? Yeah, uh, no, 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 God, no, no. Why, would, why did she agree to go on a date again with I mean, me? I mean, I was just That wondering. many times. No, 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 different, different girls, different girls. Bad online dates, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, now that you've been in a relationship for 10 yes. years, yes. what is the best relationship advice you can offer? You know, I always tell people, I, uh, I, this is what I would tell my single friends, is just like chill out a little bit, you know? Like, I, and you know, I'm not in that great a position to give advice because I don't know what I'm doing, but I feel like a lot of people get too up in their heads about dating and they like, like find red flags a little too soon or they're like, I don't know. Like I had a friend who used to go like, I was like, oh, how'd that date with that girl go? And he goes, I don't know. I couldn't see myself having grandchildren with her. And I'm like, you know what, man, give it, just give it a couple more weeks yeah, and yeah. see how things develop. You know what I mean? Like sit with it a little bit. You know what I mean? Or when people say, oh, this guy, why won't he text me back or whatever? It's like, well, maybe because he's just an idiot and you need to give him a little more time. You know what I mean? Like people, people just like chill out, give it another shot. You know what I mean? Like there's, it gets a little bit too fraught and people bail too quick sometimes and like sometimes you just need to give it on the other hand if it's a really bad situation get the hell out but you know what I mean if things <laughs> really go south life. yeah <laughs> right. yeah, so, yeah. Awesome. But, but no one should take any advice from me on dating I don't know anything <laughs> well thank you yeah. on that note yeah. <laughs> thank you it was such a pleasure to thank meet you thank you so much pleasure yes, meeting you too absolutely